Now this is more like it. Now this is more like the time I heard this the past 20 times while waiting to start the next recording because apparently when making this game, the developers thought what we really needed was the same line of dialogue being said every goddamn time, 30 seconds past and nothing has been pressed. And now it's time to see what's inside this temple with a hallway that ends way too soon and just results in a trap door within like six feet. Except I didn't fall down the trap door that I could easily see. It teleported me to somewhere that wasn't actually there. I'm sorry. Did I just find a temple in the middle of the jungle? Rumbling like there were a hundred Sibians on at full power inside it. I fall down six feet in. There's a flying purple mechanized dragon. No, this is exactly what I expected. No, no, what you're talking about. This is completely normal. Now, I know I've never been one to nitpick, so this will come as a shock to you that I have to question this, but I, I just have to ask, why is there a snake spurting out water in a perfect rectangle? I think if I could come down to the square root of all my problems, it's probably looking too far into every little thing. Man, I really liked that black void abyss there for a second. It really reminded me of the death on the horizon where the lights go off and you're all alone with nothing but nothing thank you game i play this to escape the horrors of reality not to be haunted by them and i said that before i realized we were actually connected to the abyss just a casual crossover with dark souls so that we could just stare headlong into the black empty narrow hole that is our soul and realize that well actually if i fall down this little bit i'll start a fight with the four kings bring it on bitch no the fuck the fuck did I do? What? <gasps> what the hell did I do to the camera there? I don't even know! I was just walking into a wall and suddenly... Bye! Okay, now I know I'm probably not supposed to be up here. But I think the least you could do is actually, you know, maybe clip this properly, model it, and give it collision so I don't just fall through it and see through everything! There wasn't even a wall there. There, there wasn't even a wall there. Oh, that JPEG background. Oh my, I, I know. I know it's an old game. I, I know, but oh my God. I don't even have a joke. I don't even have a punchline. I just, I just. A cemented up vagina has more depth than this background. Oh, it's the Indiana Jones boulder. Somehow on f oh no, I never mind, you know, I can see why you're on fire destroying a bunch of snake torches down this never-ending descent and then suddenly no ramp but is. I know it's a Sonic game, but do you, do you want me to believe the world that I'm in the environment that you're crafting? Maybe you should make it so that the environments are actually traversable by things other than Sonic. You gotta be- what the- what? Why did I just David Blaine open to the air, levitate and fly away for a bit because I was hit by a spike? Shove the spike up my ass again so I could fly back up there and not have to do this again? Again! Oh, come on! What's the button? Is it rings? Of course it's fucking rings. How is it not rings? What else would it be? Is the illuminated panels look super pixelated, poopy, not good, and shouldn't be shown? We... They disappeared. Because I monologued for a little bit. Thus meaning... That I gotta do all that! Again. Again. Ah, oh, you're the best thing in the world, yes you are Cause when you stand next to a ledge and press say you bounce off Don't jump up cause the game's well made Don't really know how you fuck it up so simply It is really bad, I hate this game It is fucking driving me absolutely ballistic and I wish that I'd die Please don't disappear, just fucking do it Holy fucking Louia, the game actually worked May I remind you by the way that we only found this temple By falling out of the sky after jumping after Eggman and losing Eggman And now we're just here Staring at a mural of Chaos the Dragon, which looks real cool. And I believe Knuckles is huge with a mushroom on the other wall. So in other news, there is nothing new or befuddling about any of the things happening to me. Except for the part where we just teleported to another place in time where there's a temple on fire. Where am I? This is really weird. You know what, Sonic? I think for the first time in a while, you and I are on the same page. I don't even know how the hell you just time traveled. You looked at a painting and you ended up somewhere else? Give me, a, give me a picture of a world without this game. Give me, give me a picture of that so I can stare at it and that can become my reality. G give me a picture of that. I am losing my mind. Hawaii trees in the jungle. The temple, it's on fire. Everything looks like red jello. And I wish that I would die. Ah, oh, dead chow. Just to really set the tone that everything's terrible. 
I mean, you know, this is like the one thing in this game I like, and you've, 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 you've taken it and you've ruined it. You've murdered it. How they died so far from the fire, I'm not sure. Who are you? Why is your arm hurting? I agree, why? Why don't you do- there's a river behind you, get a bucket? Help! Jesus! Oh, that's it, Sonic. Just hold your left leg and think about jerking off while staring at disaster. Don't try to help with your- It's not like it'll create wind to put it out or anything. You're a terrible human being. Excuse me, you're a terrible hedgehog. You're not a human being. You couldn't even be a good one. You're just not. Oh, hey, it's Eggman. Let's, let's not acknowledge the part where you just slid on the floor without moving your legs. Eggman! Why would you scream at Eggman getting his attention when he doesn't know you're there and you could sneakily follow him? You're the worst hero ever. Oh. So, where's the game crossover with Sonic and Prototype? So I can play as a super crazy, amped up, insane son of a bitch, mechanoid Sonic. With, um, with guns for fingers and thumbs, dolphins for shoes, and the Game Grumps background for eyes. Where do I go to get that? Or alternatively, we could always try out Eggman's super prototype masseuse machine with the pinprick needles that'll just rip your skin right off. What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. How will I ever get past these awful obstacles? Oh. Oh no, one jump. Oh god. Oh, I feel physically exhausted. I exerted myself so much, I don't know how I will ever live. Oh no. An infinite supply of weird bouncy ping things? Better just climb this ladder as they bomb themselves to death. You know, Eggman? It was a shame you didn't uh, build these things with the capacity to climb or jump. Or do anything but awkwardly wiggle and self-destruct. There's only like a hundred of them down here. Totally a good good way to spend resources. If only Eggman didn't always give me an escape from his bloody plan. Not the vortex to another dimension whirlpool. <laughs> what is this game? Oh. Oh. Why the fuck? Plaything dolls of us. Casually in the bad guy's lair. I don't know what that's supposed to represent. Is it, is it the cliche put a face on a dartboard thing and he was just throwing shit at us? Or is there, is there something a little bit more sinister involved there? Has Eggman got a kink? You wanna fuck us? Does he just want us to be helpless, cuddly, and adorable? And just constantly interacting with each other. Put it that way. If he does, all he needs is an internet connection. Is your hardware to, to, to run a basic browser? And the, the knowledge of DeviantArt, and he'll be just fine. Why were there soft plush toys of us in the middle of Eggman's lair? I have never felt more violated. Well, if it isn't my pal, Sonic. Well, if it isn't my pal, even worse rendered Eggman with exact same looping animation. Um... The room's falling apart. Sonic panicked and flailed up on a rocket, and now I'm fought. You, you, you've got to explain some of this. Some, is, is this game? Am I in game now? Egg? V Viper? You, I understand the decor of the room, but I don't quite understand why you've referred to yourself as a reptile. Uh, it, uh, hell with it. Just it's do the thing where I can hit you so we can get this shit show over with. Why would you do that? Of all the things you could do, with the thing that fires missiles, lasers, flamethrowers, why would you come out of the mouth of it and thrust your cock around in the, in the, in the, in the, in the thing as if you've defeated me when I'm on full health? What is wrong with you? <laughs> that's his damage sound. I have- I am unable to care about this game anymore when that's the damage sound. <sighs> it, it sounds like a, a yawn gone wrong. It doesn't sound like the sound of someone who's being murdered. Is this really the final egg? I run around and dodge some laser tag play pogo stick on his viper and smack him in the face it's no use give up D did he just say it's no use get on the spinning needle and you can make it to the cockpit oh my god why does everything have to be spelled out to me for a moment i wasn't sure and i was enjoying the mystery the moment i don't know something fucking little ball comes in it's just like hey want to know how to do it without figuring out here you go game for babies no get a load of this Get a load of my cock in your head! <laughs> I don't know why, but that laugh kind of sounds like Arnold Schwarzenegger going a little bit mad. <laughs> Get to the egg carrier! I'll... You put that chaos emerald down! No! This is the fun, this is the best, this is the worst boss in the game Cause there's nothing I can do and it is driving me insane I just sit here and I wait for you to do the same thing You do absolutely nothing and it is making me want to kill myself You boring bastard, just please fucking get on with it The same thing over and over and over and over again
Get on with it. Get on with it. Get on with it. Get on with it. Hey, pal. Hey, buddy. Old fella. How you doing? There you go. Jesus Christ. Thank fuck for that. It was only like 20 minutes. He's spinning out of control. He should be dead from goddamn motion sickness at this point. How's he not been flung out of the cockpit? Watch out. He's up to something. What do you mean he's up to something? He's dying. Oh. He... He tried to suicide dive me before dying a awfully fiery death right in front of me. As Sonic no sells it, as if the loss of life is not something that should be mourned, even if they're a little bit bad. What? How are, how are you? How am I here? How are you there? How are you alive? You died. You didn't. What? What? What, what, what is going on? That's Crush Forty in the background, isn't it? Yeah, sure is. Also, don't think I didn't see Sonic breaking on the stairs back there. Why is there triumphant music as Eggman escapes? And we just run around hopelessly, having fun as if kids running around with their hands in the wind? Uh, I'm... Sonic wasn't... Sonic wasn't saying anything! I'm sorry! But it's, it's the canon of the Sonic universe that he's actually the vocalist from Crush 40! What the fuck was that?! Happy whale. I wish I could be a happy whale. I'd do anything to be that fucking happy whale! Oh! And uh, that's the closing image of the Sonic campaign, actually. After rocking the fuck out and enjoying his Crush 40 song, he goes to the beach, has a nice drink, puts some shades on, and just suns himself and relaxes, while Eggman is out there, free, like a felon on the run. I, I, the scene at the end of Banjo-Kazooie, where they all sit down on the beach, with the woman with the big melons that were supposed to be the boobs come along, that makes sense! Story was done. Sonic just fucks off and frolics and just doesn't care! Ah, uh, hey, uh, thank you, world. I believe I've had my attempt at saving you. Can't really be bothered anymore. Eggman's still going around rampant. Could try and lock him up, but you know what? No, I'm gonna kick my feet up. I'm gonna sit on the beach. We have a good old time. Did you b b b b b bye now? I can safely say, without a shadow of a doubt, that unfortunately for me, despite that image, the story here is not finished. Because I do believe we still have many... Miles to go. Yeah. And that's the end of the video. If you did enjoy it, please do like it, share it, subscribe if you haven't already, do all that fucking fun stuff. There's some merch in the description down below. You can peruse and just check out if you want, or maybe even buy some. It's up to you. There's also some videos on the screen right now. You can pick from any or all of them. Hell, I don't really mind. I'm appreciative of you just goddamn watching this one. So, I'd be thank you for your patronage. If you enjoy it, thanks, and see you next time.